Welcome to the Solar Edge Learning Lab. This video will guide you through replacing the digital board on our three phase inverters. Always ensure that the system is de-energized prior to working. To do so, turn the inverter on off switch to the off position. Wait for the DC voltage to bleed down below 50 volts DC. Turn off the DC safety switch and remove the top cover. Insert a blank micro SD card into the SD card slot located at the top of the communications board. Access the menus via the four button interface. Long hold on enter and the password is 123-12312. Use the down arrow to scroll down to maintenance. Then select board replacement. Select backup and wait for the board replacement process to complete. Once backup is complete, turn off AC power and remove the micro SD card. Remove the communication board as well as the wires that run to the LCD button and pull straight out of the inverter. Set the assembly aside on a non-conductive surface. Next, remove the screws for the mounting brackets. Once complete, pull the digital board directly away from the inverter. Note that the screws are small and easily lost. Keep them in a safe place. Highly recommended to take pictures prior to removal. Remove the ribbon connector from the digital board. With the board removed, detach the brackets from the old digital board and install the brackets on the replacement digital board and install into the inverter. Next, replace the Phillips head screws and reinstall the ribbon connector. Once this process is complete, reinstall the original communication board by reversing the removal process. Align the communication board to the standoffs by lining up the holes for your Phillips head screws. Once the boards are in place, insert the micro SD card and turn the AC power on. Your inverter will download the information from the micro SD card to complete the board replacement. You can manually start this process by going to maintenance, then SW or FW upgrade. Thanks for joining us in the SolarEdge Learning Lab.